So why we need to minimize the states of the DFE is to say whether the language of the two DFEs are same. So to say that we need to minimize the states of the DFA. So let us see how to minimize the DFA. So the first step is to remove the unreachable states. The states which are not reachable from the start state, we call them as the unreachable states. So such state we have to remove first. Next is to identify and condense the equivalent states into one. So let us see what are equivalent states. So the two states P and Q are said to be equivalent if and only if any string W which is accepted by starting at P is also accepted by starting at Q. So it means that if the this machine with the start state P, if it accepts the string W, then Q also should accept as well as if W is rejected by the first machine with the P as the start state, the second machine with the Q also as the start state should also reject that string. Then only we say that the two states are equivalent, which are here in this case P and Q. So in general, it means that two states are said to be equivalent whenever both the machines will accept the same string as well as reject the same string. So let us see the example computing the equivalent states in a DFA by making use of table pill filling algorithm. So here we have a DFA which is uh, having the start state as A and the final state as E and uh, the transitions are as here. Now, so in pass one, what we do here is mark the accepting states not equivalent to the non-accepting states, which means that, so here if I consider E as the final state and E as the start state, so with respect to E, all other states are distinguishable. Distinguishable means they are not equivalent. So because E will be accepting and other states are not accepting. So that is the first step. So which we can say show here. So initially I have to prepare a table with the dimension. Here you have the states from A, B, C, D, E, F, G until G. So prepare the table from A to uh, G that is here you have G H so you leave one here and then from B to H this will be your column so rows will be A to hmm, the rows will be from B to H and the columns will be from A to G then initially with respect to E because E is the final state and uh, with one final state one non-final state you mark it as a cross indicating they are not equivalent. So put a mark between accepting versus non-accepting state. So E is the final state, A is the non-final state. They cannot be equivalent. So put a cross. Then B is a non-final, E is a final. So put a cross. C is a non-final, E is a final. Cross D and E. And similarly E with F, G, H also put a cross indicating they are not equivalent. Next step is with respect to A, on some input alphabet. So with respect to A and H. So take this uh, alphabet 0 and 1. So A on 0 goes to C and H on uh, 0 goes to F. So C is also non-final state and F is also non-final state. So leave that. Next. A on 1 goes to D and H on 1 goes to E. So which means uh, A will reject the string 1 whereas H will accept the string which means that they cannot be equivalent. So put a cross for A and H. Now come check the order pair A and G. So A on 0 goes to non-final state, G on 0 goes to final state which means they are not equivalent. So put a cross. So likewise you uh, take the pair A, H, A, G, A, F, A, E, and A until B. Now you will show what is the why we have left blank. So A and F. So A and on 0 goes to C. F on 0 goes to F. Both are non-final state. And A on 1 goes to D. F on 1 goes to B. So both are 
going to the non final states on both 0 and 1 so i am not going to put a cross they may be equivalent that's the meaning of lefting leaving blank so likewise for a and b also i cannot distinguish by one alphabet so i am leaving it blank next similarly compare the ordered pairs bh bg pf bd and bc so now you will come to know that so these are not equivalent and this may be equivalent next see with the, the d f g h now if you do that so this will be the case and c and h if you see c on uh, one goes to final state h on one also goes to final state c on zero goes to f and h on uh, zero goes to zero so now i have put a equivalent saying that because both on one as well as zero they go to the same state that's why i put a equivalent they are equivalent here i have put not put anything because they are going to different state but both are uh, either non-final state or either final state that's the meaning between blank difference between blank and the equivalent equal means they are going to the same final state or same non-final state on both the alphabets and similarly do the remaining pairs so now this is on the one uh, alphabet now in the next iteration you have to take the uh, remaining that is uh, a and f uh, you compare so a and f if you see a on uh, 0 goes to c f on 0 goes to f so c f you check c and f if it is already cross it means that a and f is also cross so that's why you got this cross so it indicates that on the two alphabets so this will be not equivalent so similarly b and f also not equivalent but a e and b are equivalent therefore this is a minimized uh, state so whichever is the equivalent so that means here c is equivalent to h d is equivalent to g and a is equivalent to b so you got three pairs of equivalent states so the equivalent states are a is equal to b c is equal to h d is equal to g now the construction of the transition diagram will be obtained by removing one of the states in the pairs so i will be removing b g and h and combining them into one single uh, pair pair with one state so a c e d e f because a is equivalent to b so b will be replaced by a itself c is equivalent to h so h will be replaced by c d is equal to g so g is replaced by d i will be retaining only these many states this will be your minimized dfa so retain only one copy for each equivalent set of states now with this we will come to the algorithm uh, and uh, the special case will be like when you have multiple final state the same approach you have to consider so now both d and e you have to consider as the final state and do the same procedure so putting all together the minimization of the dfa will be like this so first eliminate the states which are unreachable from the start state so you have to check whether uh, which are the states which are not reachable from the start state then use the table filling algorithm to identify the equivalent states and remove the equivalent state that means out of two states you retain only one state and write the transition diagram then output the resultant dfa this is a procedure for minimization of the states in the dfa Thank you.